in today's video, I'm going to teach you how to create a project in Adobe Premiere Pro CC very quickly, easily and simplified. Yo guys everybody, I'm Bray Moses and welcome back to my channel. So without further ado, let's head over to Adobe Premiere Pro. As you can see, I have already opened the program. So once you open and start up Adobe, you're going to see this window pop up, be it on your Mac or PC. And here you'll be able to see the recent project library, new project, settings, or we can go down to the settings and click on new project. Or even click on the existing project to resume our editing. So if you want to create a new project, you click on new project. Or head over here and click on file and then click on new project. So once you open your new project, we shall have this. And this may leave you wondering, what the heck should I do next? Wait just a minute, you don't need to panic or get scared. It's pretty simple to move forward. So what you need to do next, so we need to go ahead and choose a name for our project. I'll call it how to create a new project on Adobe Premiere Pro CC. And then the next thing you need to do is choose a location where you save these files. I always save my files in an external hard drive or an SSD to prevent my computer from running out of space. So I'm gonna browse and locate where I'll, you know, save these files. And I'll leave the settings just the way they are. So basically inside the scratch disk, you have the opportunity to choose where you can save the small files, which are sometimes called the scratch files. These files basically increase performances inside the project. So as default, Premiere Pro will save these files at the same path as your main projects are located at. So you don't need to do anything about, or you don't need to change any of these settings. So here basically you need to do two things. One, you name your project and then two, you need to choose a location where your project will be saved at. And as simple as that, we are good to rock and roll. So we shall go ahead and click on OK and boom, we are into Adobe Premiere Pro interface. Wow, you made it. We made it. We are now into the Premiere Pro interface and it looks pretty confusing. With four different panels, yet this is, this is where the most interesting part begins. Your journey to professional video editing and making professional films has just begun. Your journey has just started. Let's rock and boom and roll. So here we shall have four different panels. The first one is the project panel, secondly the source panel, thirdly the program panel, and lastly the timeline. All these different four panels will help us edit our videos so smoothly in Adobe Premiere Pro CC. If you're new here and this video is adding value to you, could you please consider subscribing, click on the notification bell below to stay updated whenever I upload new contents in relation to filmmaking, editing, photography and self-development. And for my returning subscribers, thanks so much. Love you all. So lastly, the next thing we're gonna do is create a new sequence. And to do this, we head over to File, New and then click on Sequence. And choose one of our pre-made custom uh, sequence presets and boom, we are good to edit our videos. So, for an in-depth video on how to make a Premiere Pro CC sequence, please watch the next video right here. Thanks guys for watching, Wi-Fi high five, see you in the next video, love you all and peace.